What really went wrong with the Boeing 737 MAX? It was supposed to be Boeing's most advanced 737 ever, but instead, it led to two deadly crashes and a global grounding that shook the aviation industry. The Boeing 737 MAX. What really went wrong? Was it the engine, the software, or something deeper? Section 1. The Bigger, Better Engine To compete with Airbus, Boeing needed a more fuel-efficient 737. The solution? New, larger CFML EAP-1B engines. These engines were great, quieter, greener, and cheaper to operate. But there was a catch. Section 2. A change that changed everything. Because they were bigger, these engines had to be mounted higher and farther forward on the wing. This changed how the plane handled in flight, especially at high angles of attack, or when the nose is pitched up. The result? The aircraft had a tendency to lift its nose more than expected. This created a higher risk of stalling. To fix this, Boeing added something called MCAS, the Maneuvering Characteristics Augmentation System. Its job, push the nose down automatically if it sensed the plane was about to stall. But here's the problem. MCAS relied on just one sensor to tell it if the nose was too high, the angle of attack sensor. If that sensor failed or gave incorrect data, MCAs would trigger even if the plane was flying perfectly fine. That's exactly what happened on Lion Air Flight 610 and Ethiopian Airlines Flight 302. Section 3. The Crashes In both crashes, MCAs repeatedly forced the nose down. While the pilots struggled to pull it back up, they weren't even told MCAs existed. In total, 346 lives were lost, and the 737 MAX was grounded worldwide. Section 4. The aftermath and fixes. The Boeing redesigned MCAs too. Use two sensors instead of one. Limit how many times it can activate, give pilots more control. Well, after over 20 months of review, the 737 MAX was cleared to fly again in late 2020. But the damage to Boeing's reputation? That may take much longer to repair. Lessons learned. So was the engine the problem? Not directly but changing the engine placement caused a domino effect, one that led to software fixes, hidden systems, and ultimately, tragedy. In aviation, even small changes can have massive consequences. If you found this breakdown helpful, hit the like button, subscribe, and let us know what topic we should dive into next. Fly safe.